down 28 to 6. The Seminoles rattled off 30 straight points, including a 23 point swing in about 6 minutes and 13 seconds as Florida State took out Ole Miss. Defense dominant in the second half. Three turnovers to Marcus Walker was everywhere as the Knolls defeat 11th ranked Ole Miss. 45 to 34. You got to score at the end of the half, got to score there, then got a turnover. And, and that's what we don't, I say that all the time. You hear me say in my press call, momentum's something that we don't talk about in, in sports enough. We all want the reasons why, but once momentum swings, sometimes it just goes. It takes a heck of a group of kids to turn it back, and we were able to do it on our side, and we kept it enough on our side. They, they almost come back and had a big drive to go back up. They got a heck of a team, but momentum is critical. You know, we just stayed composed. That touchdown was really big. That gave us a, a um, it gave us a really momentum going into the second half. We knew we were getting the ball, so we had to score before the second half. So that touchdown was huge. That was a great catch by Rudolph. Um, you know, I stood in there as long as I could, but and I just let it go. And I just prayed that um, you know he made the catch and he did. At halftime, and, and that's the thing that I wanted to see everybody eyes and everything, man. You got a guy like Matthew Thomas coming to the locker room, man. Just telling the defense, just make plays. Just go out there and just be us, man. And, and you got a guy, a red shirt freshman, a young quarterback coming in, man. Just telling the offense, man, I got y'all. Y'all just be comfortable. And when you see a guy come in and do that, man, it do nothing but just, just motivate you and want to go out there and just play even more. Man. Yeah, to find, find that heart. You know, we talked about it all year, what we worked for as a defense, and, you know, defense carried this team, but in the first half, offense carried us. So we had to we had to dig deep and look in each other's eyes, and, you know, the game ain't over. Let's move on to the next play, and, you know, dig deep and fight. I knew that nobody can block me in the country, so I had to, you know, just go out there and do what I can do. It's big, man, because, you know, if we can cover the guys, you know, it makes it, it makes his job easy. And if he can get to the court, it makes our job easy. So it, it works hand in hand. So, you know, that was a big he, – he cranked it up in the second half, him and other guys, and, you know, we came through. Defense was outstanding in the second half. I mean, first half, they had their, their things. But that defense, after they felt us getting a surge on offense, I mean, they swarmed now. I mean, they create turnovers. They create sacks. They create havoc. You know, that was my first game. So, you know, it was some things I was seeing, but I wasn't sure. And, you know, uh, just – First time started, you know, I just had a lot of first time jitters, but once I got settled in, you know, got banged up a few times, I felt better. I knew French was going to do good, you know, even from last year when he stepped on campus, you know, was a scout team guy for us, giving us good looks, the perfect balls he threw, you know, just accuracy he got, the mechanics that he worked with, I knew that he was coming out here, you know, just control the huddle, take care of the offense, and we were going to come out victorious. I see it every day in practice, so it's not a surprise to me. It's just, man, I'm just so happy for him, man. Everybody them grew up, man, and they just know what it takes. We just got to keep buying in and taking that next step. And I feel like if we keep taking that next step, we'll be the team we want to be. Also of note, Ricky Aguayo, perfect in his freshman debut, not unlike his brother Roberto. And now Florida State has a quick turnaround as they take on Charleston Southern at 12.30 on Saturday in Doe Campbell Stadium. Make sure you get out and support your Knowles. Some beautiful improvements to the stadium you don't want to miss. That'll wrap up things from Orlando, LaneHurtSeminoles.com.